Hi Simmers! It's the Solar Simmer here and welcome to my channel! This is the first episode of my Single Moms Club LP. Woo! I'm so excited! Before I get started, I want to let you all know about my intro video. There's another video that I will have linked below that I made for you all just to get to know me and get to know how my channel is going to be run and what you can expect from me and my LPs. So that's a good video that I hope you all will check out um, before or after watching this. So let's get into it. I am so excited to be doing this LP. It's been a dream for so long now. I've been planning and just doing all the, the works for it for a long time now and now I'm actually finally ready to do it and I just cannot wait for everyone to see it. It's going to be so great and so much fun and I'm actually really excited to finally get to play with these ladies. Um, as I mentioned in my intro video, you'll see um, I will not just be playing one household. Oh no, this is the single moms club. We will be playing four special ladies and what I'll do is I'll bounce from house to house. Um, after however long and the ladies are going to be able to interact we're going to know each other and we're going to get to know each of their stories you know in their own light and it's it, that's i feel like that's what's going to keep it so interesting you know there's going to be twists and turns everywhere because there's so many different aspects to it four actually <laughs> so let's get started um for the first few episodes, what I'll do is I'm going to introduce you to one lady at a time and I'll read the description that I have there for them. I want to start with my Constance because she is really my pioneer woman for this LP. She's the reason that I came up with this idea. Little backstory, um, she was a part of a household that I was playing maybe years ago. Um, she was a child the last time I played her and at the time I had a mod that I'm sure you're all familiar with it's called MC Command Center I love that mod it's a great mod if you want some realistic game gameplay I don't have it on my computer right now but at the time I did and I had it on a setting where um, the non played sims and all the other people that you're not playing with at the time, they would have a life, you know, like they would get married, they would have kids, they would move out, they would move in, they do all those things. So um, when I finally came back to check on this family that I had, the parents were dead and the children were adults and Constance had a baby. <laughs> and I was like, well, you know what? It's time for me to split her and her brother up and maybe I'll go back and play her. And then I was like, well, now she's a single mom. I have no idea who the baby daddy is <laughs> and what am I gonna do? So it just hit me and I was like, oh wow, I've gotta do a single moms club. At the time, um, the, I forgot what the expansion, Get Together. Get Together was new and it was all about making clubs and things like that and I was like, oh yeah, she needs some support. <laughs> she needs a nice little support group. So she's, you know, kind of my pioneer woman. So let's get to it. This is Constance and Jim. Constance is a doe-eyed, rambunctious young adult from Arizona. After her parents died, her and her twin brother began to harbor hateful feelings towards each other and decided to split shortly after their trust funds were released to them. Young, alone, and unguided, Constance took her riches and began to live the fast life with the stars. After some carelessness made her a mother, Constance realized that's not the life she wants for herself or Jim. Let's see how this life with Constance is going to go. I am so excited. So as you heard from the um, description, Constance is a bit of a rich kid and she's also real familiar with the stars. Um, so she's living in Del Soleil Valley, AKA LA. <laughs> I just feel like Del Soleil is so California. It's so LA. And so this is where my celebrity sims must live. Really so this is Constance. This is her humble abode. And that is baby Jim over there. <laughs> so I'm going to uh, show you around for a little bit. This is her nice little house. Um, I got this house off of the gallery, I believe. And I just kind of juiced it up a little. But I love it. It's, it's so Cali. It's real open and... 
I thought this is the coolest thing ever. I feel like if I ever was to have like a house in California, I'd want it to be open like this, you know? Like I thought that was so cool. So yeah, she's got her little grill area, her nice little pool and her great view. Oh my gosh, like look at the strip. Yeah, oh my gosh, she's right next to the Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Okay, yeah. So this is Constance. I'll probably um go into her outfits and show you guys all that soon. But for now, I just want to get started, see what we need her to um do and see who she can meet, you know? Um, I'm thinking since she's the, you know, real charismatic girl, she knows everyone and she's such a friendly girl. I'm thinking she's going to be the lady who starts the club. She's gonna um, realize she needs some support, you know, all her friends are stars and they're busy with their lives and, you know, they're not enough. She's gonna need some real down-to-earth ladies who can help out. So I think Constance is gonna be the one who starts the club. Oh, wow. <laughs> so yeah, so what I have set up for her is I want her to be a bit of a... Um, what do you call those? Like an influencer. Like, that's gonna be how she gets her fame, her riches. She has over here the producer station where she'll make videos and she'll upload, and, you know, things like that. You know, let's start a vlog right now since you're all happy. At the moment, Constance has two stars. So she's, she's doing pretty good. She's got a little bit of money left after blowing it. And this is her twin brother, her actual twin brother. Please. And I'm guessing they started to rekindle the relationship a little. It's Smirks. been years. They haven't seen Shumba each other uh, after they split. He doesn't know much of Jim, but he will get to know him. Jim's sleeping right now like a little angel. And yeah, I, have, I literally have no idea who Jim's father is. I am, you know, it's beyond me. I have no idea. <laughs> Jim's pretty Ooh, hungry, so they say, smooth. so let's go on and feed him. I don't know why, that's so strange. For some reason, she can breastfeed him. I'm like, is this yeah. not your baby? Definitely is. Little Jim Lothario. And yeah, when I came back, his last name, I cannot remember if it was something yeah. else and if I changed it to Lothario, but I have yeah. no idea who the father is, so it's not even like I can help them build a relationship. So yeah, it's just going to be Constance and Jim. So he gets some new right. aunts to help out. Change her diaper, Jimmy. Aww. But yeah, so she's going to be a bit of a mogul. So let's see what we can buy for now. Let's get you a good camera. Because we're going to need you to start making some good, good videos, girl. And once she does a few videos, we'll probably get her a job. And, um, she doesn't have any degrees, so that's not going to help much with work, but hopefully yes. her status in life, <laughs> hopefully her name will go far. <laughs> See, does she have any, yeah, she's going to get a little bit of influencer boost and some networking. Oh, and she's super emotional, yeah, we know, girl. Too much tequila. Oh my gosh, it's Valentine's Day. She needs a boo. So obviously her, um, oh wow, let's do this now, huh? I think I want to make her style influencer. Doesn't have much style. Social media, yeah, that's it. Um, she's going to definitely be an internet personality. Let's do it. You'll start as an intern, girl. You gotta start from the bottom. But yeah, what was I saying before? Sure, let's get started. This Miko's crazy. She is just Fun she brought so. She's Spupa. super beautiful. Her parents were great. Um, the father was an NPC sim that I'm sure you guys with are probably Sona familiar Zarspa. with. He was Don Lothario, Pensive? and then oh, it was great. a lady that I had made before. I cannot remember her name, but she was she was beautiful for sure. <laughs> And they had twins. De Prodi Verbi. They were just so cute. And I seen them last, but now she's just all grown up and so beautiful. Yeah, girl. Oh, okay. So yeah, 
She has the soulmate um, lifestyle that she Shady wants to Bluey. complete. Yes. So we need to find her a boyfriend. Brody Beckenoy. Mifla Yishla Quiz. She has all these friends, but no one to love her. Hmm, Diego, how about you? Sergio, you definitely look like her type. Congaloy, hmm. Prody Marina, Noba, Asbuk. I was kind of late. Sergio will probably oh, be upset if <laughs> you move. call him now. Let's get you some food, girl. Let's like we'll make, we'll make mom some no food. So, off camera, I went through and I made relationships with some of the ladies. So, some of them know each other and some don't. And from what I can see, Constance does not know any of the other single moms. So maybe she'll meet them in passing. Maybe she'll meet them through a mutual friend. Who knows? But at the moment, she is just out in L.A., living with the stars, living the high life with her little baby. She doesn't realize how hard it is yet because, you know, she's got the money. She's got the space. But soon Jim is going to become a handful and she's just not going to know. How to do Brody this all alone, Beckenmore. without mom, Mifle, without Yishla, dad, Quiz, plus just her, Claudizoy. no support from her brother, Rubishavi. I'm thinking Boy, I want to get them to be closer, uh, a lot closer, um, when I came back to see them, that's how I knew that they were just so messed up, their relationship was horrible, and so I tried to fix it, tried to, you know, boost it up a little, and so now they're okay, but we'll see, he's married, maybe we'll get closer to his wife and try to have her squeeze us back in. <laughs> See if he'll take us back. Espinal, Das Griffin. Oh, look at Lurby all the stars. Scoop. Is that baby Ariel? I don't think she knows baby. Ariel. Oh, she's not gonna want to talk about. She looks really busy. Oh, look at this view! Like it's just so beautiful. Imagine living here. Like I'd stay at this fountain every day. I'd go outside, get a book, and just sit here and just bask in it. I love little lights like this. I have these all over my house for no apparent reason. It is not Christmas. <laughs> beauty review video. Ooh, what should she be reviewing? Let's do a fancy beauty review. Because who doesn't love a little Riri, okay? And of course, she's uh, familiar with 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 Miss Riri because she knows everyone. You know, she goes out, she's in the clubs, she meets all these cool celebs. So of course, she knows Rihanna. Of course, she does. Don't know why there's two of them, but we're gonna edit that as soon as we get some time. See what you're cooking there. I most recently got. Um, these snowy days, snowy escapes. Hmm. <laughs> what face is that? <laughs> snowy escapes um, expansion pack. And there's so many sushi options and so much Japanese food. And I just love it so much because me, actually, <laughs> the solar simmer, that's my favorite cuisine. If it's not hmm. Japanese, it's Jamaican. I'm Jamaican. Or hmm, Mexican. I love those Eva? three. That's like, if I had hmm. to eat nothing else, hmm. I would choose one of those three. And oh. they just have all types of sushi. Oh, girl. They just have all types of sushi in here now. And it just makes me so happy because it's like, oh, yes, yum. I would love this stuff. Like, oh, look at this. I would eat this whole, this whole tray by myself. Breakfast, breakfast, lunch, and dinner. <laughs> Yeah, after this, I think I'm going to go into her outfits and show you guys her. So you can get to see Constance and just how freaking pretty she is. Wow, girl. That's like my favorite part about The Sims is genetics. Like, you really don't know how the kids will turn out. And then when they do come out just like beautiful, it just makes me so happy. I'm like, oh, wow. <laughs> oh, wow. Speed this up, girl. Yeah, she has a drone here. I've never used these drones, but I hear they're for streaming. So we're going to stream some footage. Spy on some people. Why not? Got punked. 
<laughs> no I wish they let you do that. Sure. Like, do, like, a punked video or something? That'd be great. Okay. Do you hear them? So, this is Miss Constance Lothario. Nice brown beauty. <laughs> so, this is one of her everydays. Let's see how many we got. I do not remember. It's been ages. I've just been sitting on this egg. <laughs> waiting for it to hatch. <laughs> Here it is. Oh, yeah. This is really cute. This is cute. Oh, yeah. Ah. Since then, I've gotten so many more mm -hmm. um, expansion packs and, like, stuff packs. So, I'll probably need to go in and add some more stuff. There's lots of cooler things that we can add now. That's very pretty. I've always loved that dress. Roadshow. Roadshow supplies. Did I skip over something? I did. Roadshow. Oh, ex-boyfriend's teeth. Don't we love those? Yeah, girl. Yeah, girl. Oh, I did get um the one with the spa. I think after I made this, so I can definitely change up that um, athletic wear. It did not look too good. Doesn't look like it's fit for a star like her. Looks like something I would wear <laughs> around the house. So let's fix that. Yeah, let's actually change that now. Maybe the shorts can stay, but I'm, I'm just not liking how it's looking together. It's looking real frumpy. <laughs> mm, let's see. Anything that matches? Nope. I've always loved this thing, but not for you. Who, who would want to work out in this? One wrong jumping jack and your boobs are out, okay? Show for the whole gym. Maybe that's what you want, <laughs> who knows? I love that shirt too. Hmm, maybe it's the pants. Hmm. Maybe that's what we'll change. The cute sports bra. I know there are, oh, here we go. I'm like, I know there are cuter things. There we go, that's looking a little better. That looks way better. I might just leave it like this. You know, I'm not really, a, in real life, the Solar Simmer is not a sports bra workout kind of girl. And I work out every single day. I'm a complete gym rat. Like, I love the gym, but it's just like, working out in my sports bra has not been on my list of to do's yet so yeah constance is a bit childish very family oriented she loves her gym he wasn't planned but you know he's here and she loves him and she's a bit jealous so that's probably what caused the riff with her and her brother he might have gotten more attention than she did and she's like you know what if i'm not getting in arizona we gotta get out of here <laughs> we gotta go to the hills we gotta go where people will notice me for everything that I have, for my beauty, for my brains, for my, you know, everything. And that's what she did. And maybe there was some animosity with her whole family because of that. We'll never know. They're dead. <laughs> Sad to see you go. Oh, she had an awful Valentine's Day. <laughs> Sounds like me in a few weeks. <laughs> Always a bridesmaid, never a bride. Oh no, Jim needs you. What's wrong, Jimmy? Jimaru? Jimbo? Oh, it's Jimbo. That's it. I like Jimbo. Okay, so she did get a project. What was the project? Get to know Jim's in the spice market. We can definitely do that. Maybe we'll bump into one of the other ladies. That sounds like a good idea. So we'll do that after we wake up. We weren't really ready. Thank you, Jim. Are you hungry? Yeah, let's feed you and then I'm going back to bed. Okay? I just love this little setup right here. Um, I had one of my cousins her apartment was like that she had like a fireplace and then she put candles there and it had her tv so i was like oh yeah this is perfect i gotta do that the little room is just so cute like i just love this house whoever made this house i have to find it in my gallery and shout you out because this is just the coolest little setup like i would love this um Honestly, I'm, I'm, I'm fronting right now. I might not <laughs> love this. This is kind of not safe at all. This is very low security. What's wrong, girl? 
even that overly emotional stuff she's got um, postpartum. It's just a baby. Just just give him what he needs and he'll be quiet. That's how I am though with babies like oh my god please stop crying or I'm going to cry. <laughs> Sometimes kids are just too much. Like they really know how to stomp on a nerve. They just ugh. I don't have any kids but I do have nieces and nephews and they were handfuls so props to their parents. Oh what's wrong now girl? Oh god she can't even sleep. Thanks, Jim. She's just gonna lose it now because <laughs> her life is so freaking hard. You know? No. It's just too much. She just needed that good cry. Let's have some. Let's have some breakfast. Breakfast. Fruit salad. Maybe you need to go jogging. I like to keep my uh, Sims fit unless that's just not something that they're interested in. If I have like a glutton Sim or something like that, if they're just not. You know, I feel personalities. I feel these Sims like they're real people, even though I make them. Um, a lot of the times I'll randomize things anyway, but even if I make them and I choose everything, I still let my Sims show me what kind of Sim they're going to be, if that makes sense. I don't know if that sounds crazy, but that's how I play it. You know, if my Sims show me that they, you know, want to watch their figure, we're going to do that. And I think Constance would be one of those. She has to look good. This is just so pretty. I'm absolutely in love. So why can't we see any of these things? The Kamago- uh -huh. Wow. I can't look at other people? Well, don't worry, your little heart. We're gonna become a global superstar. Sooner or later. So, after uh -huh. Constance eats this fruit salad, we're gonna go ahead and go down to the spice market mm. and see who we can meet. Oh, so Constance is eating now and since we want to go to the spice market let's work from home see what they want us to do and then we'll go to the spice market afterwards so I have 150 social media followers we're almost there give confidence speech uptown so let's get confident how are we gonna do that babe we'll figure it out um we need any do some who doesn't want a warm light? Now let's leave it bright. Mm. Type this next video, then I could probably edit this next video before we send it out because that always helps. Oh, very nice store, but I'm gonna edit this video. Oh, see if we can oh. increase the followers a little, and then we'll go down to those towns. City life was one of my favorites. Even in Sims 3, when they did the vampires and you had the city, like, that is just my favorite thing. I'm a girl from the city. I live in the country now, but I was not born here. And I'm just a fast life kind of girl. I need the fast life. I want the fast life. So when my Sims are in the city, I just feel like, yeah, this would be what I would be doing. Like, I would not be in, um, what's that other one where they gave you for the um, pets. Ugh. I know in Sims 3 it was called like Appaloosa Plains. <sighs> Can't remember what it's huh. called for, but yeah, I wouldn't live there. That looks so hunky-dory. <laughs> it's beautiful, don't get me wrong. I just feel like that's for someone who's ready to live a slow life. Like retired people, rich people who just want to be out the way. Like that's where you need to go. In the hills somewhere with their horses and just chilling out but if you want to be in some stuff and you want to have options around you fun entertainment food the city is where to go so i don't know if she has any editing skills oh look her brother hi roman you know they don't look like twins but i remember they were twins they look nothing alike <laughs> hi roman good to hear from you maybe we'll go visit him Oh yeah. Oh yeah. She does have a media production skill. She's almost a level two, so that's gonna help with these videos. Uh, Christmas all the way up there. She loves to talk. Ha ha ha. Fitness, logic, parenting. And a little bit of singing. Hmm, maybe. 
Hello, Constance. We need a celebrity partner to help promote TV dinner, a basic cable television channel as part of a targeted advertising hmm. campaign. Mm-hmm. Use the video station. Oh, yeah, we can do that. TV dinner would love uh -huh. footage of you personally cooking. Or we can do that using this drone. Oh, yeah. Who doesn't want a larger payment? We're going to use that drone. Got to figure out how to use it. For sure. Ha, ha, ha. All right, girl. Why is this taking so long? Come on. What is she doing? Is she editing or hyping? Because hyping should not take that long. <sighs> Gonna speed this up, and then we're gonna head out to those markets. Oh, well, she's done. Let's get out of here, girl. Where should we go first? Should we go to the spice market, or should we go uptown? I guess we should go uptown, because that's gonna help with this for now. Girl. Whatever, I guess I can't do it now. Let's do that. Let's see if this helps with followers real fast. And then let's get out of here. Diola! No. I don't even know who you are. Why would I travel with you? Uh -huh. I don't know you. Imagine calling up somebody you met in Walmart and being like, hey, you wanna go down? Uh. Oh yeah, let's go uptown. We're confident mm. now. It's over. <sighs> Let's get this money real quick. Oh, look how fast that's going up. I love it. I love it. I wish I had this much pull. One post and I get 60 followers. What? You guys better like, comment, and share if you like this video. Let's get these videos up here. Let's get this page up there. We need we need everyone to see this, what we got going on. It's gonna be great. Let's just head to the spot for a second. Ooh, maybe you'll get a little massage while you're here. But yeah, I think this is going to be such an interesting LP. Like, oh, I just don't even know what's gonna happen. And that's what's so much fun about this, you know? I don't have everything planned out. I probably have the first five minutes of every episode planned out, and that's about it. I'm just reading it. So this is gonna be great. Oh, uh, uh, yeah. uh, Hmm, can we give a confident speech? Can we? Let's give a confident speech and hope we get some more social media followers. Ooh, and you put on your nice outfit. I love this. I love it, girl. Strut. I love this outfit. I'm a fan of rompers. It always makes you look good. Are we not confident anymore? Oh, that is so annoying. How do I get confident? What can I do? Do 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 re be re be ba re do. Oh yeah, hey Octavia, you wanna be friends, oh. girl? La, be your la, hubby, your friend. La, oh, we are friends. La, <laughs> la, What's up, girl? How am I gonna get confident? Oh, can I go to like a mirror and get confident? Who loses confidence that quickly? Girl, you need to get your self esteem up. See. Like self up? Does that do it or does that give you energy? We'll see. Ooh. We'll see, we'll see. I always loved how uptown looks. There we go again with these waterfalls. My favorite. My freaking favorite. I always wanted to go down there and they won't let you. <laughs> it's so cool. Oh, they have the same lady going back and forth. <laughs> the businesswoman. The hookah. Come on. Are we getting confident? We haven't even gotten there. Stop strutting and run. <laughs> we need to get this. Ooh. Okay, should we do yoga before we do our speech? Because who doesn't love yoga? No, they'll have another one. They always do. Come on, girl. Get some confidence. You got it. Oh, I'm nervous. You got it, you Whips got it. Orb. Oh, this spot is so pretty. I've never... Okay, I'm lying. I've been to, like, a spa where they do your nails and stuff. But I've never been to, like, a big spa like this where they have massages and yoga classes and mud baths. Oh, my gosh. I cannot wait. A sauna. What? Okay, wrong way. We're confident, though. So let's go. Let's go. Come on, girl, before you lose it again. We know how you are. 
I just love this outfit. <laughs> I was on it when I made this. I probably didn't even make it. It might have been like one of those pre-made outfits. But no, I'm really hands-on with my Sims. I'll use like pre-made things sometimes, but I always revamp it. If I use one of those pre-made outfits, I'm gonna change something, you know? Because the Sims, they, the people who make it, they got a little bit of style, but not all the way. There's always something they forget. Something that could have made it better. A lot of the times, if I use like uh, the randomizer for a Sims features, I'll randomize it until I think I got a good like starting place. Shish and then I'll mix them up. Shoop, soon up our emboya. Like I said, I love that control. Come listen to me, somebody. Uh, you guys aren't interested, but I'm so confident. <laughs> Come back. <laughs> Doesn't matter. We're here for the coins. Anna Herb Waffenub. My boss is gonna appreciate it. Alfonso Clodazoy. Gelda. Crow up and blush. Jeans sharp. Down. What? Tell them about the trash. Hey, come listen. No. Okay. Tell them about the trash. Alfness Yibs. Oops. Zombo Skiba. Zuba tube, love about, a zuby. Not about social media or something. Stupid. Bar bahoy, imbo, sharnoof, shabney, fribby, employ, yo yim, yo yim, yo yim. You got it. You Woo! got it. Yibs. Punk After this, we need to try to get you those Plata last fumo. fifty followers. Wanu. What's up? Spone new Well, I totally just Alibar did a bar and they mershow. Check it out. I posted it <laughs> on my story. Bora hey. Yeah, that's what she said. Bo. For sure. Joe da vep. Sharnu shaved me. Yoman. We'll go to some karaoke and invite someone out. Ooh. Let's go to this lounge. See if we meet anyone. You know, she does want to find love. So, we should definitely work on that. Maybe invite one of her girl pals over, find a wingman, see who we can meet. <laughs> We're definitely gonna change this outfit, girl. You don't come to the club like this. This is not how you come out. You gotta step out at all times. This isn't much better, but hey. Candy? No, not Candy. Megumi? Octavia? Octavia just doesn't seem like she's in our age bracket. Let's try Kayla. She seems like our age. Is she a young adult still? She is. Okay, good. Got time to make you mature. Come on, Kayla. We're, we're waiting on y'all. Grab some drinks and for the time being. Yeah, what do you get here? Hi, girl. Hi, girl. I don't know why we're going to So, at this point, I realized my Sims volume was way too high. Um, I couldn't even hear myself. So, it's just a learning curve for future videos. I have to remember to turn my Sim volume down. But basically, um, she went to the club. She's meeting with her friend Kayla. And, you know, they're chit-chatting. And the coolest thing ever is about to happen and um basically one of the moms are going to come in so this is one of our other single moms in our single moms club lp that's eliza you all will meet her soon and so i decided to have her chit chat with eliza you know there's a girl she met at the club and you know that way they got a contact some familiarity and then it just brings it all in and i'm so excited i'm glad it happened like that I assumed that, you know, maybe she'd meet them outside one day. So this was perfect. On the first episode, this was perfect. So she's just going to chat with Eliza. Her and Kayla are going to chill and, you know, get to know her. Eliza's an artsy girl, if you can't tell from the way she dresses. Um, she's going to ask about her career and her interest and things like that. So, of course, they... Stayed at the hookah bar, did their hookah, <laughs> I call it a hookah, they call it a bubble blower, whatever, we all know what it is. <laughs> and yeah, um, she just kept chatting with Eliza, and I think in the next part, whenever we get to Eliza, I don't think she'll be next, but whenever we get to Eliza, we're going to have her meet back up with our girls so that they can become friends, because it seems like they hit it off at the club, 
They seem really friendly and really chit chatty. Now it's time to go home. God, he looks kind of cute. Too late. We gotta go. Sorry, Jim is calling. Jim needs his mom. So, yeah. We're gonna try to see what she gets for her hard work. You know, her effort that she did today. And then maybe hit up Miss Eliza and see if we can get rather acquainted. Oh, hi, Jimmy. I'll come see you in a sec. Oh no, I'll come see you now. You're crying. But what did the sitter do? What am I paying you for, this lady? Why is his birthday not on here? That's so strange to me. Is it on Easter and it's just being overshadowed? No. Does Jim not age up? Yeah, this is weird. Like the detail, the detail. I've always loved The Sims for the detail. At one point, I had this really crappy computer and I could not put my settings on what I have now. And it's just not as fun. Like this is the high life. If you have a computer where you can set the settings to a decent, you know, setting, this is when you enjoy it. Otherwise, it's just like, boo. Can make you eat something before you go to bed. Sing a little. Sleep a little. You know what? We'll upload that video in the morning if she still has it. Because I don't know where it went. And then see how that video takes off. It's, it's doing great. Can we edit it anymore? No, you can't. So... We're just going to upload that in the morning, probably record one more, just for our stash, Ugh, and call it a night. So Jim is back to- oh, wow, promotion! What? We'll go to work today. How did we get a promotion so fast? Because we're just that girl, okay? We do this. Oh. Jim, you are just... Vicara Woga! Oh, I have to pee, and you're just not allowing me to, you know, have my basic human rights. I, I gotta pee, I've gotta, I've gotta live my life, I gotta brush my teeth, I gotta eat. Come on, Jim, don't be selfish. After she eats, we're gonna upload this video. And... Maybe a record another one. Some fashion, some beauty, some fashion, some beauty. Let's do some fashion. <laughs> we'll do that after she eats. Oh, I'm gonna have a long sun time. So obviously I'm gonna have to age them up myself randomly one day. Let's see. Maybe springtime. The start of spring. They never usually babies any longer than this anyway. There's always like a week, so yeah. And the first flower buds. So will Jim. Oh, girl. You ever have to actually do that walk? Oh my gosh, I've had so many moments where, like, if I don't get to the bathroom within the next two seconds, it's over. These pants are done. I don't think I've ever actually walked like that, but still. We've all had those times. Constance, the footage is ace. Oh, <laughs> double whammy, we got to use that. Catching waves at, oh my gosh, check out the next award ceremony at seven. Oh yeah, we definitely gotta do that. We definitely gotta go to the award ceremony, if we're still around, if we're still working with Constance. Uh, well, looks like you're not gonna get to eat. Thanks, Jim. So, Constance is gonna go to work now after her new promotion see what they've got for her what else they'd like for her to do and I think I'm gonna end it here um, when we come back you're gonna meet a new mom and we're gonna see what she's got going on and meet the kiddos and you know learn about her life thank you guys for watching I hope you enjoyed this part so far if you did please like share comment and subscribe hit that notification bell so that when we post a new video you'll know and 
comment what you know what you like about it what you don't like about it if my voice annoys you let me know <laughs> no, i'm just kidding um i won't always sound like this i have a cold i'm sorry i sound like a walrus underwater it will get better anyways thank you so much for watching it's your girl the solar simmer and i hope you're having an extraordinary day bye guys